At this time, I would like to welcome our scholar body president to the stage to share a few words. Now, she is a tremendous example of a servant leader, someone who is making a difference in our community and who has seized every opportunity to learn from those in her life and apply that knowledge to becoming a wonderful example of a John Adams Academy scholar. Ladies and gentlemen, please give a warm welcome to our scholar body president, Lauren Bixler. Thank you, Mr. Sprinkles. Honored guests and beloved grandparents, thank you for being here today as we celebrate the tremendous impact your goodwill and support have had on the furthering of John Adams Academy's mission and vision. Restoring America's heritage by developing servant leaders who are keepers and defenders of the principles of freedom for which our founding fathers pledged their lives, fortunes, and sacred honor. My name is Lauren Bixler, and I am the Scholar Body President. This school has been my home for 10 years. It has changed my life, my family's life, and the lives of many other scholars and families fortunate enough to be a part of it. I am pleased to have the opportunity to share with you today the meaning and significance of a classical liberal arts education. At John Adams Academy, the classics are the core of what scholars study, discuss, and reflect upon. Instead of reading others' interpretations of the greatest minds in human history, we face them directly. We peer into their thoughts and reflections in a vulnerable and personal way. We have conversations with them and with each other. The classics connect us not only with humanity, but with ideas and experiences that transcend time. When examined with intention, the classics elevate us into a state of inquiry that leads us towards intellectual freedom. They teach us how to think critically and rationally. They reveal to us how little we know and inspire us to want to know more. In the traditional, non-political context, the term liberal has commonly been understood by its Latin etymology. Liber, the root of liberal, means freedom, particularly the state of being a free human being. The term arts, does not refer primarily to such things as sculpture, painting, and music, but arts in the sense of learned skills. For example, the arts of grammar, logic, and rhetoric, all are skills that must be learned in order to be applied. Essentially, a classical liberal arts education teaches us the knowledge and skills necessary to exist in a state of freedom. This education not only liberates us from intellectual slavery, but also equips us with the skills necessary to live as free individuals. This education is the only proper one to prepare people for citizenship. As the success of our republic depends on an educated and virtuous citizenry committed to the principles of freedom, Using our freedom well is the only way to ensure its future as our founders envisioned. At John Adams Academy, we learn how to be free. Every scholar, regardless of where they are in their educational journey, is on the path to freedom. We are united in that common purpose. Through our examination of the classics, and with the guidance of our families and mentors, we continue to learn and pass down 
the values and traditions of those who came before us. We recognize generational wisdom must be protected and perpetuated. We venerate you, our elders. We revere your experience and wisdom and rely on you to guide us through the storms of life. We count on you to help us preserve and protect the institutions that further our pursuit of goodness, truth, and beauty. Your support is essential to the mission and vision of John Adams Academy. Without you, none of this would exist, nor would we. The fruits of your love and support are manifested in the hopes and aspirations of every John Adams Academy scholar. Rest assured, your contributions never go unnoticed or unappreciated. It has been our honor and privilege having you here today. We are grateful for all you do in support of John Adams Academy and its scholars. Today, we honor you. Thank you. She's impressive, huh?